So automatically, we've got some dicey territory where uh, it's hard to do, like, you kind of have to address the elephant in the room regarding Flint, Michigan, um, but you don't want to do it in an insensitive way. Uh, so maybe just do some line about... Uh, uh, so maybe I do some line about Flint, Michigan, where our government will never abandon us. But uh, yeah, I, I, I don't want to be insensitive to the actual victims of the problems in Flint. But uh, so yeah, uh, basically this short is about uh, <laughs> Yes, the obvious Flint joke about Fred and Wilma. If I use uh, any jokes inspired by anything you say in the chat, I will be sure to uh, credit you. Well, I, I will first ask you if it's okay, and I, then I will be sure to credit you in the riff proper. Um, so yeah, th this... Uh, This short is about uh, General Motors reaching a milestone uh, in the cars they produced, uh, uh, making a record number of cars and celebrating that. And so there's a lot of targets, you know, there's a lot of obvious jokes I have to cover. Like I have to do some sort of Roger and me joke. Uh, with all the celebration of cars, I have to do some sort of, you know, a, a young John Lasseter was transfixed or something. Um, yeah, there's there's a lot of material given the subject matter, but uh, yeah, I, I can't ignore. I, I I can't ignore the elephant in the room regarding Flint, Michigan, but I want to make sure I'm not insensitive to those who have actually suffered in Flint, Michigan. Yes, we are 30 seconds in and we're already in a problematic area. <laughs> Thank you, 50s. Oh, this is a day. The whole town's a bustle. Yes, to read, there's going Dunn's to be a bustle. And what's a parade without festive bunting and gala decorations? And bands. So the boys <laughs> are called to practice their strut. What unflattering framing. <laughs> Put on sleek and shiny floats. For this parade is going to be a mile long. It's the first ever drive through that comes to the car. Town folks have to be hustled over the road to make it on time. And in the town auditorium, a troupe of Broadway and Hollywood artists. General Motors Futurama. Symbolizing the Definitely a reference can be made there. People everywhere. For their show is to be played to a standout audience of very important guests. Hundreds of guests many of whom will arrive in Flint on a train pulled by a glistening diesel. A golden engine for a golden day. Yes, sir, there's excitement from coast to coast on this day. Everywhere General Motors people are at work. For today in the USA, the entire GM family is playing host. With open house at every plant. For this is a special day. A once-in-a-lifetime day. A day of achievement there. for the whole USA. For on this day, General Motors is building its 50 millionth car. No one has ever come close to that before. So no wonder celebration is in the very air.
The bunting and decorations are up. The floats are almost ready. The red carpets are up. Brian De Palma wrote that carpet. The signs of welcome are proudly displayed. Mothers are bringing the children to town. For on this day of days, parking is no problem. For Buick has provided us because all the cars the are drivers. in the factory. I don't know. And Buick's general manager Ivan Wiles drops in. And now on the Chevrolet. <laughs> Looks like a Don Lake character. An historic event is about to occur. With some of its millions of predecessors marching before, and the first of more millions following behind, a golden chassis arrives at the body drop. I got a golden chassis. Well, this day in American progress, for the scurrying clock of history is striking ten. This Tuesday morning of November twenty third, nineteen fifty four, as down from aloft, nineteen fifty four, the golden body of a car that's been forty six years in the making. For they really need to increase their productivity. Of American productive achievement, unmatched anywhere at any time. The manufacture by the people of one company of fifty million motor cars. This is achievement. Achievement by a great nation, by the hundred and sixty million free people of that nation. Achievement of the burning of thousands of fossil fuels. General Motors working together. Must be added the work of the countless thousands who supply GM, and the countless tens of thousands who supply them, and the thousands of dealers and salesmen and servicemen who sell and care for GM products, and the investors who entrust savings and earnings to GM, and the millions upon millions of customers whose confidence also has helped make possible this day and this event. So with pride shared by every GM man and woman everywhere, Chevrolet's general manager T. H. Keating marks the occasion with General Motors president Harlow H. Curtis. T. H. Keating and Harlow H. Curtis. And a privilege for Chevrolet to produce the 50 million car for General Motors. There's something there. History making achievement, and all who had any part in Wellfield very proud. It is a pleasure for me, Mr. Curtis, to present to you the key to the 50 million car. Thank you very much, Mr. Keating. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Uh, men of Chevrolet and Fisher, my sincere congratulations. You have just helped accomplish something that has never been accomplished before. You have produced the 50 millionth car built by General Motors in the in the United States in the in the United States this is a milestone unique in the world's industrial history it was the vision of a fair handful of men here in Flint that lost that launched General Motors in this guy's Bob Cummings grandfather the automobile industry was a struggling infant at that time. In other automobile companies, the same vision existed. Vision of the automobile, both as an essential means of transportation and as a creator of jobs. And as a destroyer of environments. The development of an industry that makes the greatest single contribution of any to the strength of the national economy. Over the years, it has constituted a principal source of our country's dynamic growth. The 50 millionth General Motors car produced in this country stands as a symbol of vision of accomplishment to date. This guy calls himself a car manufacturer. He hasn't called anyone a pedophile. For the future. 50 million cars. So hoist those flags on high, blow those whistles, and start that parade. Charlie, I like that melted Eisenhower. And I believe the rest of the short is just watching this parade and narrating it a little bit. Ah, uh, this is a day. 
The entire GM line is represented here. Glistening new models of the famous five that make automotive history every day. Oh, there's there's definitely something in there. The 50 millionth GM mention of 50 million. With surging power for the wheels of progress. Electromotive with a revolutionary power for the wheels of steel that put new life in the old iron horse. Fisher body that's led a parade of beauty from the days of demure Miss 1908 to modern as tomorrow Miss 1955. <laughs> UAW CIO representing more than 300,000 members of the mighty GMT. AC spark plug, as if you couldn't tell. AC spark plug, my favorite save by the Bell character. And sludgy, who all work together too to make this nation strong. Okay, I gotta do something with that creepy dog. Institute that helps train men and women to carry on the tradition of achievement. And turns them. I appreciate that. I'll, I'll, I'll be sure to credit you if I use any of them. And of course, little did they dream it. Here's the very first GM car, the 1908 Cadillac that started the biggest parade of industrial products in all history. And GM's million, a 1919 Oldsmobile. And the five million, a Pontiac from way back in 1926. And the ten million, Pontiac cutting a rug. Of only three years later, 1929. And the 25 million. A Chevrolet of only yesterday, 1940. Oh, it's a great day, all right. A salute to Mr. and Mrs. America. To but all mostly America, all nations. Wait. Who as one people have pioneered and protected the way of life that is the USA. Whose courage, confidence, and cooperative accomplishments are proudly symbolized here today. By this unparalleled achievement that marks a milestone of progress, pointing the way towards still greater things for all of us everywhere to share. Teamwork, teamwork, the nation's secret was teamwork. And no doubters and scoffers can live this as far as you can. GM answers, you ain't seen. All right, so that was Achievement USA. And I think that is a uh, strong contender for a riff. I, I think there's uh, a lot we can do with that one. Um, there are a couple of other uh, potentials I have for next month. So even if I don't use that one this month, I'm sure I will riff that eventually because uh it's it has the exact kind of pacing you want for a mystery science theater target it's got the um it's got th that exact level of hokiness that exact level of uh <laughs> yeah just just misguided earnestness that uh i think makes for quality riffage mm -hmm.